It was a great opportunity for me to, uh, to put together an exhibition in the informal atmosphere of the Kenny Arts Festival, you know, because I've been used to working in more formal structures like museums and galleries. I had my own gallery for a long time, uh, which was a great luxury. So it was nice to come back and sort of be invited to curate a show in the atmosphere to get here. Yes. The particular exhibition I'm curating is called Surface and Reality and it includes the work of 11 artists. They're all artists whose work I've known for quite a long time, mainly Irish. There's one non-Irish, Susan Phillips, who's Scottish, but she actually lived in Belfast and then lived in Dublin for many years. And uh, she's now living in Berlin, as is Owen McTighe and Declan Clark and Kieran Walsh. And Kieran is particularly interesting because he's from he's a younger artist mm -hmm. who's just coming up and uh, he lives sort of uh, he comes from the, the area around Kenny Carlo. And uh, so he'll have a very interesting installation piece in North House. Declan Clark will have a film piece in North House as will Willie Doherty. And I like to think that there's a pathway around Kenny because there'll be five locations. There's North House the woodland of Kilkenny Castle, which will have a beautiful piece by Susan oh, Phillips. And then the corridor of Kilkenny Castle will have all McTighe. And then uh, the rooftop of a car park. Okay. Uh, yeah, multi story car park. Uh, so, up to top of that, Dennis McNulty is doing an installation. And then in a uh, series of conference rooms in 11 Patrick Street, we've sort of uh, converted those rooms into gallery oh, spaces. Yeah. And back at the Pembroke. Back at Pembroke. And uh, so there'll be five uh, sort of artists showing there. Very, very different spaces. Very different spaces and very different work. And yeah. I think that's what's going to be exciting about this exhibition. So there are many different sort of strands of work, types of work. It's a serious show. It's an opportunity for people who just want to be introduced to the visual arts or people who know a lot about the visual arts. Yeah. And the nice thing is to be able to take time and sort of, you know, go into each venue, take time out walk around, so it's a nice pathway, it's a nice stroll. I think the first, the most important thing is to leave all your preconceived <laughs> notions of what art is outside the door and just go in and have a look and then take it as it comes, accept what you see and then it's not easy, I accept it's not easy because it is a specialist interest, you know, uh, it's like any sort of interest that people have, so uh, it does take time and so I suggest everybody just take up this time. We'd also hope to have sort of some publications around available in sort of Roth House and in 11 Patrick Street uh, that people can refer to and look at again, sort of in hopefully a more relaxed atmosphere than sort of perhaps the former museum. Of all the artists, sort of Susan Phillips is the one who's sort of sound art and it's her own voice and it's very beautiful and uh, it's, it's a piece of work I suppose people will have to, you know, could easily come upon yeah. and wonder what's going on. And that sense of surprise and excitement is very nice. Uh, Declan Clark will have a new piece, a new film piece. Um, Kieran Walsh is doing a new installation. So there are several new pieces of work. Ferris Martin, the painter, is doing something new. Michael Coleman, his are all new works. Uh, Stephen Lockman. And then there's Esna Jordan with very interesting paintings. Sort of, um, people might be familiar with her work. And so there was, it's a recent series she's done around sort of, uh, um, buildings in Vienna. And um, William McKeown, which is sort of very beautiful abstract painting. So uh, I think there'll be lots of different types of work, uh, all put together by the one strand of sort of what you see is not necessarily what might be there, what might be there is not necessarily what you see. I think it's, a, it's an exciting show, it's a very beautiful show, and uh, I think it's a great sense of celebration around it.